All right, it is 2.51 p.m. Saturday, July 1st, 2023. All right. Um, I'm going to show you what I got from Walmart. I'm going to tell you in advance, this little bit of stuff costs only the expensive amount of $52, which is actually... I'm just kidding when I say expensive. This is actually cheap compared to what it could have been in today's world, but I'm going to go on. Okay, so the first thing I got was uh, this Aussie Miracle Coils Nourishing Oil with Cocoa Butter and Australian Macadamia Nut Oil. It's 3.2 fluid ounces. It was like $5.50 and like 50 cents or something like that in total. I figured it wouldn't hurt to try it. I've never used it before. They were almost sold out, so I was like, hey, they must be good. Got a thing of feminine wash. They had my favorite one in stock, finally. They haven't had it for months, so it's like... They haven't had a lot of my favorite products in stock for months, so I had to use alternate items. Like, seriously. I did not need to buy body wash, shampoo, or conditioner this month, because I already got some last month. I got, like, double of everything, and my cat's on the bed, obviously. She ju I just got home like 10 minutes ago, and uh, yeah, that, that's just it. I got some eye drops. I got this right here. I wanted to try this. This is a CeraVe Makeup Removing Cleanser Balm. I've heard some mixed reviews about this, but I just want to try it for myself because... I like makeup remover stuff. If it works, cool. If it doesn't, well, then I'll know not to get it again. It was like $10 for that little bomb. I'm like, well, it wouldn't hurt to try it. So, you know. I got a shower cap. I think I already said that. It was only like a dollar and seven cents for this. I'm like, Walmart has cheap shower caps again. That's cool. I had this one before. I know it works pretty good, and it's a good size shower cap. I got my favorite face wash from CeraVe. I've bought this one several times. Um, I got this. Kids Tom's of Maine Natural Fluoride Free Toothpaste. This is the only one they had left. So Tom's of Maine must be good. I got this from my mouth guard because my mouth guard says to use um, fluoride free, no chemical, uh, toothpaste on it because it could harm the mouth guard, like it could like make it go back to different shape. And I said so, to have something like that on hand. And I said if it doesn't work, I could just give it to my sister for my nephew. It was only like three dollars for something for that tube. It was like the last tube in the whole building. I looked for like ten minutes down the toothpaste aisle trying to find that very one. She said to get that one, and, and if it doesn't work. I'll give it to my nephew, because he's a toddler. You know, toddlers don't really know how to uh, brush their teeth very well, so, you know, they usually swallow toothpaste, and I'm like, yeah, I better not throw this away. It says it's fluoride-free. I'll read it again. It says, natural fluoride-free toothpaste, gentle cleaning, tastes great, dye-free. Oh, cool, it's dye-free. I didn't notice that. It did say to get dye free too, but it also mainly said just mainly worry about to uh getting uh no harsh chemicals, like do not use dish soap, do not stick in dishwasher, which I don't really know anyone who's ever stuck their mouth guard in a dishwasher. That's uh not something that I would do. I have uh this problem where I grind my teeth at night. So, yeah. This little tiny bit of stuff cost $52. But it could have been more, so I'm just grateful it wasn't 52 More than 52 I spent in total like 53 or 54 today because I got a water at TJ Maxx. I was going to get my hair oil, but they were actually out of it. And I have like less than half of a bottle left. It might last me the whole month. That's why I got this because I heard about it being good for... Curly hair. It doesn't specify a hair type on here, though. I don't think, unless it reads it in the back. Let me see here. 
Let me read the back. And now this is my first time reading it, so don't judge me if my speech crawl max up or I mispronounce a word, because I can read. It's just I've had trouble with reading most of my life. But let me let me go back to this. Prep your coils to take on anything. Our miracle coils, nourishing oil infused with cocoa butter and Australian macadamia nut oil nourishes hair from inside out helping to fight breakage and visibly repairing your hair to experience our little miracle dispense oil into hands and run through wet or dry hair indulge in the yummy fragrance and enjoy Yay, cocoa butter and Australian macadamia nut oil. Yay, awesome hair days. Yay, no parabens or no hair stress. Now, I don't know if it was supposed to come with a lid. Hi. You having a bad hair day too, Dio? Sorry, you don't need to see that. She just likes being around me. I don't know why. It looks like they did, but none of the ones I've seen in the store had them. There was like six or seven of them. I just was making sure they had no damage or anything. My Pantene bottles that look like this all come with lids, so maybe if it's supposed to come with one, I can probably snap one of those on there. It's no big deal. They're empty, though. So let's look at this CeraVe makeup balm. Hmm. Take my glasses off to look at this because it looks like it's white. Which I kind of expected it to be. If it works good, we'll find out. But I'll do that on a day when I wear makeup. It doesn't smell like it has a scent. If it does, it doesn't have much of one. As for this toothpaste, I'm going to grab the uh, toothbrush I bought last week to clean it with and go clean it while I'm in the bathroom. Because I'm actually done. I'm just happy I didn't have to buy body wash this month. <laughs> and uh, shampoo and conditioner. I'll actually show you why I don't have to buy body wash for at least a year. Let me get my uh, slip-on shoes on. They're actually over here. I do not like wearing tennis shoes around the house, but I don't like being barefoot. I threw them down right here when we went to go to the store. So I wanted to wear more supportive shoes. I got to do some laundry when my family's outside. See, so I got this one. I'm actually going to put that in the caddy because I, I need to. That wasn't supposed to fall. Actually, those need washed, so they were supposed to fall, I guess. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Getting ready to be 10 bottles of body wash. Actually, 11, because I do have the scrub one up here, too. <laughs> I won't need to buy body wash for at least a year. I'm getting ready to be out of my favorite Japanese cherry blossom one. I will still buy the um, Bath & Body Works brands, because I do like to use those, and I want to sparingly use all of this stuff. And my mom likes the Mary Kay ones, so I'll probably just give those to her. I don't think she liked this one very much. She tried it once and didn't like the scent. It's the uh, apple and almond. I liked it, so I said, don't throw it away. Give it to me. She said, okay, take it. Handed it right to me, no problem. She likes Olay. And uh, I got, like, one face wash left. Well, I'm going to go. Um... And I'm going to put my stuff away, but you don't need to see that on camera. Anyway, it's 3 o'clock. If you're new, please subscribe. Go follow me on Instagram. Peace. Have a wonderful day. Bye.